Unilateral posterior anterior mobilization of the thoracic spine. What does the evidence say? Evans 1997 found that unilateral mobilizations of the upper thoracic spine were beneficial in T4 syndrome. This is a Maitland mobilization technique of the thoracic spine and can be applied to all thoracic levels. Technique. With the patient in prone, stand at the side of the bed at the level to be mobilized. Maitland uses the thumbs, but it is easier to use the pisiform to apply the pressure through the transverse processes. To do this, interlace your fingers, palm to dorsal side of the hand for extra reinforcement. Place the pisiform of the underside hand onto the transverse process and push in a posterior anterior direction over the transverse process. This is a Maitland mobilization, so use the Maitland mobilization grading system for the technique. Grade 1, a small amplitude near the starting position of the range. Grade 2 is a large amplitude that is in the free range where no stiffness or spasm is found. Grade 3 is a large amplitude that is moving into stiffness or spasm. A grade 4 is a small amplitude stretching into stiffness or spasm at the end of the range position. As with the cervical spine, it is common practice to perform several sets of over one minute of mobilizations. Here is the technique again, but on a model spine to show you what to feel for. references.